Hello, party people. It is Will Pemble. It is what? Saturday? Lyle's around here somewhere. Hey! Woo! So we're gonna go up to the coaster, plan on the layout for the Iron Dragon. So we're planning on making it similar to the um, RNC hybrids. So I was thinking a lot of reverse bank air times, that kind of thing. We can't make it go upside down because, well, it's gonna be made out of plastic. We should rename it the Plastic Dragon, but we're not going to do that because that doesn't yep. sound cool. Look, there's the uh, there's, there's the, the last of the track. Look, we chopped it all up and tore it all down. Uh huh. Except for that, that one piece is. Except for that one piece, which is like the, that's like the garden gnome. It's the it's the lawn sculpture <laughs> piece of the original caution zone. But it's like all yeah, it is a it is a, okay, a tragedy. So all right. It used to go down there and then up across there which it's not quite as fun. So why don't we start it up here and then go down this steeper drop? Oh, come down this way? Yeah. And then what happens here? We do this like really steep, crazy steep turn or? Yes, exactly. Ooh, okay. So it's like an overbank. And then we turn right here and then it right over here, we don't want it to be crashing into the bushes. So one, we're gonna trim that. Two, we're gonna make it so it's a it's a banked airtime hill. It goes kind of like that side banked on the hill. We're gonna have to move it over a little bit this way. And then over here, here's where I was planning to have the reverse banked airtime hill. It goes up reverse. Out this way? Yeah, that way. Okay. That's what they do in a lot of RMCs. Oh they yeah. They counteract the airtime by making it go the other way. Right. They counteract the lateral G's. Instead of making you go into your seat, you go out of your seat. Okay, cool. So yeah, you I get a great it. amount of airtime. Remember on Twisted Colossus, that one airtime hill that was the yeah, wrong way? Yeah, it feels, it looks like it's going to be all wonky and uncomfortable, but then you end up with this great, this yeah. great So we'll have turn. to figure out how to make it so it's like really smooth. And then right. instead of just keeping on going up, we can have it go down. Right. At this point, it'll still have a lot of speed. Right. And right here, we'll do an overbank turn. Really overbank turn, yeah. kind of like the, 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 the Front yard coaster had a pretty cool overbank turn. Yeah, kind of like that, except right. maybe a little bit up, and right. we might scooch it in a little bit. Okay. And then it goes down here, and then we might not have the speed anymore to get it all the way up there. This just came to me. If that's going, if that is facing this way, then we should go about the same height over here and then face it that way. Oh, okay. Sort of like a little high fivey. So it's like the op. It's like a little high fivey, right. and it prevents the literal head banging. Right. On the coaster, so it's like that. We're gonna maybe we could build along this along this piece of straightaway here. Maybe we could build some like accelerator. Uh, launch. Like a little launch. Well, I mean, if it starts up at the top there. Yeah, we'll have plenty of speed over here. Trust me. Yeah. Well, that that big steep turn, you're gonna burn a lot of energy in that first big steep turn. So when we'll you get out to here. You might need to do, have some kind of accelerator. And also we might start the lift a little bit earlier, like right over here. So that right. way we have more time on the drop. Yep, and the lift, we're like good at building a lift now, so we can yeah. do that. You know our stuff. Cool. Okay, so that's a that's the beginnings of the that's the beginnings of the idea of the track here. Mm -hmm. it, it for me it really started to come together when this morning we we tore down all the rest of the PVC. And there's kind of, it's much easier to imagine a roller coaster when you're not looking at a roller coaster. So, yeah. so, uh, so that's cool. And then, and then you were talking about, you mentioned we're going to, instead of doing steel track on this, we're going to do PVC. Um, we're going to do the Schedule 80 gray PVC because it's resistant to damage from sunlight. And, and it's, it's cheaper than steel. It's easier to work with. It's much cheaper than like a fifth or a fourth of much as steel. So we're going to be able to do it, uh, faster and easier this way and so we'll have to think of a reason and another thing that we might do we could lap it around this bush if we want to prevent head banging over here and yeah. that way we can actually add like another twist yep. right oh, there we'll think of we can we can do a lot of things with this we have a lot of options okay that is it from the backyard it is a terrible mess back here we're gonna clean up and get some garbage out of here and and do some drawings maybe of uh of how we ought to mm -hmm. make it come true but that's uh we're we're making progress i, I think we're uh, we might be looking at another awesome halloween coaster ride at, at present speed yeah hey 
subscribe to Lyle's channel. It just, a, it's brand new. Yep, it's some, brand new, one week old. Absolutely, and we're doing great. And Lyle's getting, uh, he's doing really fun, cool, funny, amazing stuff. And, uh, and so definitely support us in that. It's really cool. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for helping me bring physics family of fun to kids everywhere. I am Will. I am Lyle. And if you like this video, subscribe to our channel. Yes, please. And we my will. channel. Yep. And we will see you soon.